Hey guys, so you know that I have been trying to lose weight and my new job is not making that easy whatsoever. Now, I will explain to you what I mean by that um, about as best as I can. So basically, every time that I go to work, um, if it is on day shift or evening shift, whoever is cooking in the kitchen is constantly offering food. And not only is it just the cooks in the kitchen, but like our bosses are constantly ordering food for us. Like, um, I called off yesterday and the day before that, um, my first day back to work after my ankle injury, um, they ordered portillos for us. So like they ordered everybody French fries and Italian beef sandwiches plus like this huge chocolate cake. If you've ever had Portillo's, then you know what I'm talking about. Their cake is fantastic. Their Italian beef is fantastic. Um, but the bosses actually ordered those sandwiches for us. Um, and like there's constantly food around. People are constantly ordering food, like I said, whether it's the bosses, the supervisors, other um, coworkers who order food for like everybody. For the 4th of July, I worked on the 4th of July and they ordered everybody um, cupcakes from Small Cakes. Um, so good, but it's so hard to like stay on a diet plan or try to lose weight if you are constantly having food shoved in your face. Um, and basically like with the cooks in the kitchen, if people don't eat whatever they make for lunch or dinner, then they are um, constantly like trying to shove it off on you. For example, I also do um, some shifts working in the dining room, serving food. And at least for now, until we get over like the COVID protocols, because um, once we start going back to normal, they won't have servers in the dining room anymore. They'll just have CNAs working as servers during mealtimes. But, um, for the most part, like every time I've been working in the kitchen, the, one of the cooks is constantly like, oh, the residents chose not to eat such and such. Like for the one day I was there, the options they had were chicken Florentine or like a beef pot pie. It was like a deconstructed beef pot pie, um, which was like, in my opinion, it was more like a beef stew with biscuits on top of it and so like she was trying to get everybody to eat the chicken and I had a little bit of the beef pot pie stuff but she had so much chicken left that she was trying to like get people to take it home etc etc so it's like I, I constantly try to tell them that I am working on losing weight and that's why I'm trying to not eat the stuff that they're constantly bringing in but it's like they don't want to hear that like my boss the one day i told him that he's like um i'm trying to lose weight too but i'm still eating so it's like it's kind of frustrating because it's like i'm trying to stick to the plans that i have but at the same time it's like they don't want to listen to me or they're like eat it anyway type thing oh, i have hiccups sorry um so yeah, it is a little bit frustrating for me, um, but I'm trying my best. So like, I haven't been keeping track of like my actual weight on a scale, but my shirts are fitting um, looser. My pants are becoming looser. I've dropped like one to two pants sizes in the last month and a half. And it's a nice feeling, but I feel like the more that I work, the harder it is for me to avoid the temptations and to get out of like consuming the food. Like I didn't want to be rude to the cook in the kitchen when she was trying to get me to eat the chicken or the beef pot pie. But at the same time, she's like, you never eat my cooking. You know, do you not trust me? And it's not like, it's not like I don't trust her, but I told her, or at least I was trying to tell her she didn't want to listen to me, but like I was trying to tell her, you know, I usually either 
eat breakfast or lunch. Like there are some days where I wake up and I'm like super hungry, especially if I've had like a light dinner. But there's some days where I wake up super hungry and then I'll eat a breakfast and a lunch. But then most of the time I either, I do either or, like I don't always have breakfast and lunch. And that was kind of hard for her to understand. So it's a little bit frustrating trying to like not feel like you're being rude but also stick to the diet plan. So I was wondering if you guys had any advice on like what I can do to try to stick to my diet plans, but like also not come off as being super rude or unappreciative or ungrateful because I know that they don't have to go out of their way to like bring all this food for us or offer us meals and stuff. But it's like, I really am trying to lose weight. Like I need to for health reasons um, because I don't want to get too overweight, you know, I'd like to get back to a healthier weight and it's really, really hard when people are constantly throwing temptations in your face. So let me know if you guys have any advice on that and that's pretty much it for this video. I got to go to work. Yeah, I got to go to work in about three minutes. So I'm going to go, um, fill up my water bottle and head to work. Tonight is a memory care shift from 2 to 10 and then tomorrow I'm working a double so wish me luck with that and I will talk to you guys in my next video.